guys? It's Moon Collectibles here. I know I haven't um, made a video in a while, and I also know I have never made a video review, so I wanted this to be my first. And what better way to start off my um, first video review than with a fan favorite, the Rainbow Moon Chalice Room Fragrance, that is. Um, yeah, I know this isn't the original 90s toy version that they released in 94. The one that, you know, you lift, lift the lid and it would play music and light up in different colors. Um, but however, with Bandai and Tamashii Nations making the new Sailor Moon Proplica items, maybe we'll get a Proplica uh, Rainbow Moon Chalice. That would be pretty cool to see. I'd like to see how they do that. So yeah, first off, I wanted to apologize for not making a video in a while. Things have been kind of busy with me. Um, but I do still intend to make more videos in the near future and hopefully keep making videos. Um, I do have the Sailor Moon Crystal Figure Arts Zero figure on pre-order, so I believe that'll ship sometime this month, I believe. Um, and then I do have the, um, Proplica Spiral Heart Moon Rod on pre-order, and I'll get that sometime in November. So whenever that arrives, I'll share that with you as well. Uh... Also, I have a bunch of other stuff that is long overdue that I need to make video reviews of, so I'll do that as soon as I can, too. Um, so yeah, let's uh, jump right in and take a look at the packaging. So first off, we have this really nice pink box. It's incredibly detailed. I like how it, um, it's not too big and it's not too small. It's, it's just the perfect size. I want to say it's about maybe eight or nine inches tall, uh, so that makes for easy storage too. Like if you if you're one of those collectors who likes to keep the boxes, like I am. Um, on the front here, we have uh, a nice flowery detail, some roses, and like kind of like a heart shape. And then we have this nice ribbon from Sailor Moon's outfit, I think it is, with her uh, cosmic heart brooch on the front. And then we have a small picture of the Rainbow Moon Chalice itself. And then here you can see it says Rainbow Moon Chalice Room Fragrance. And at the top we have the, I think that's the crown that's on top of the Moon Chalice. Actually, yeah, it is. If you look here, you can see it. And then we have the Bandai logo. And then we have some of the Sailor Senshi bows. On this side we have Sailor Uranuses, and there's also some nice roses here. I think they're the same, oh, they're kind of the same ones that are on the front. Well, there's some like that on the front here, so I guess. <laughs> and then on here we have Neptunes. And on the back we have all the instructions and all the information you need to know about the item, how to put it together, and uh, put the fragrance in and all that stuff, and I think there's probably some, uh, warnings and stuff like that on here, too. Uh, we also have the Toei Animation official seal sticker that shows it's a real item and not a fake item. And, uh, do be careful, because I know with a lot of the new Sailor Moon merchandise, there's a, uh, uh, high risk of bootlegging going around. Like, with the SH figure arts, I've seen tons of bootlegs so you got to be careful with stuff like that so but yeah let's uh jump right in and look at the item itself so here we have the moon chalice out of its packaging and i just want to say this is a really really beautiful piece and i am so incredibly happy to have this um also i wanted to point out before i go further into this review that if i stutter or if i uh seem to not make sense in this video Forgive me, because I have just woken up, and it's kind of early, and I'm not really a morning person, so bear with me. Um, but yeah, uh, further into detail of this item, the colors are just so beautiful. I love the way that they sparkle in the light. I love the uh, vibrancy of it. It looks really, really nice. It's very vibrant and very beautiful. On the front here, we have the jewels for the uh, five inner Sailor Scouts, and then we have the heart on the top here, of course, and then the moon on the top of this nice crown here. 
On the back we have another heart and then we have Uranus's gem and Neptune's gem. Also, this time, uh, well, if you remember in the 90s, uh, that version of the uh, Rainbow Moon Chalice, the bottom was actually not metallic. It was more of a uh, matte color because the bottom was made of plastic. So I like how they're uh, including the metallic color at the bottom and not just at the top. So that's a really nice uh, added touch. Also, the bottom part is made of metal. So that's a really good uh, touch to it too. So uh, yeah, that's uh, they did a really good job. I'm really happy with this. So yeah, let's uh, open it up and take a look inside. So here we have the Rainbow Moon Chalice opened up. And now that it's open, I can smell its sweet fragrance already. And it smells really, really good. Uh, I also wanted to note that, um, like I said before, the fragrance in mine is kind of low. It's actually pretty much gone because uh, I've been using mine over the last several months. I'm surprised there's any left. But uh, so yeah, if you see uh, that my fragrance is pretty much gone, then uh, yeah, that's why. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, this is... I'm trying my best here. I'm just so tired. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so first off inside we have this nicely colored lid. It has the same metallic pink color as on the outside and as well as on the bottom here. And then on the inside we have the uh, crystal. It's kind of made to look like the uh, 90s toy. I know the 90s toy, when you'd open it, the crystal would look just like this, and then it would light up in different colors and sparkle and play music. And it wouldn't stop until you closed it again. So, uh, yeah. But this is a really nice piece. I'm really, really impressed with how they did this. But yeah, so there, if you'll notice, there are some holes here for the uh, fragrance to come out. And if you take this off, you have the fragrance. Now mine originally was up to the top here, but uh, it's been a few months and I've been using mine, like I said, so I have this much left, so, but I can still smell it and it still smells pretty good, so I'm going to enjoy it while it lasts. It smells kind of flowery, kind of fruity. I think the, uh, correct me if I'm wrong guys, but uh, I think the scent was called Serenity Bouquet, I think it was. So yeah, the inside, once you take the crystal and the fragrance out, is just pretty much like a gold little hollow space. Also, it'd be really good to store things in. I know some people have taken some of their, uh, small Sailor Moon figurines and have set their figure inside and take really cool, took really cool pictures with them. So that's also a good idea for when your uh, fragrance runs out. So yeah, um, that is uh, the end of my review and uh, I would like to hear your thoughts on this. Uh, also, let me know down in the comments uh, what your opinions are of this item. Do you plan on getting this item? Have you gotten it already? If so, um, what do you think? And uh, yeah, so please like, comment, subscribe, and I will be back with another video soon. Thanks guys.